area and karibuni back to my space so to the new subscribers <laughs> karibuni sana to the returning subscriber you know you're also welcome so today we are doing something a little bit different it's been a minute since the last vlog but today we are also not vlogging in the kitchen so today we are going to be doing various activities and uh, this is the to-do list yeah and uh, as you can see first thing the list is shaving so this hair needs to go down here today is 28th of august on a friday and i thought i'll start this vlog in the morning but hmm, but anyway being a lifestyle vlogger i try i thought i thought i'd start this vlog in the morning nikiwa kitanda lakini nyenye nilia kan for you nyenye way nikaona i was sick so i went back to sleep yeah she didn't sleep but then so far, it's around 4:30 and uh, i'll be heading out to shave then I'll tag you along in uh, most of the activities that I'll be doing through the, through the weekend from uh, today Friday till Tuesday then I'm trying to do what our next like, vlogger does and uh, before they leave the house they always show the outfit of the day but in this scenario because one uh, mango zangu zinanga vagina two they are just basic clothes but I'll try and insert something somewhere then can I send you a so stick around I promise I'm a little bit cuter or less ugly after my shift, so the current don't leave, don't leave, don't leave. I'll be back. I'm equally disappointed, but I'll explain that later with time. So let me first start by introducing why I'm doing this particular vlog. Uh it's on the date 21st of August, my birthday. So mimi kama kabida nanka na langa around 4 a.m. Damka 10, 30, 11, 11, 30, up. So this particular day, I decide I'm switching off my phone before I sleep. So that's what I did. Ah, uh, I come cut around 11 or 4. I catch a simu then. I can get WhatsApp. I scroll, scroll. We even get some money. Who missed me? So I find that I missed a call from Pay. Yes, Pay. Carry me the YouTuber. So I was wondering why she decided to call while she can text because I don't think you should be calling anyone if texting is an option unless unless your house is burning down. So we can decide to check up on her but because I recently found out this new YouTuber and she goes by the name Cindy and she starts like Hola, mi amigos, my name is Cindy. Oh, so <laughs> Mimi and the clownery in me decided to hey Hola, mi amigos, pay. So the conversation went like this. The guy went on to say to me talk a presentation. I was like, oh, I was shooken. I was shooken. Yeah. So we are supposed to be having a presentation for our final project in the final year of university. So as if that was not enough, like the lecturer has said, you're the one who's going to be presenting because this was a mock presentation and you are not available. So on the evening, you're the one who's going to be presenting because you are unavailable. Yeah. So I guess that was a bad surprise. So that explains why I went to get a haircut, though I was disappointed because it was to Zake, because it was an Ibona shop. Uh, secondly, uh, that explains why I'm vlogging so that you can see how this turns out. And thirdly, I'll be answering a few questions that I've frequently asked in my inbox over time since I started vlogging that was around uh, uh, 85 days ago. So I'll be answering the questions and also giving my opinions because everyone is entitled to their own opinions. So let me first start by saying this. I'm not a chef. I am not a chef. So don't call me a chef in text, in gossip, in along the streets or anywhere and don't call me a chef. I, I don't deserve that title and I think there are other people who will appreciate that title than I would. So I'm basically a cook. Yeah, I cook because I have to eat at the end of the day or during lunchtime or for my breakfast, I have to eat. So that makes me a cook and not a chef. So I'm not ready to become called a chef. I'm not a chef. I've never been to any baking class. I've never been to any cooking class even for five minutes. Yeah, so I do not deserve that title. And uh, yeah, there are other people who will appreciate that title more than, than I would. Come on. Me walking to school or walking to my workplace does not make me an athlete. I just have to walk there because I do not have a car or I do not have a bicycle to take me there. Also, Nikipanda Nduvi kutoka stage, hadi kwa nyumba yangu, that doesn't make me a cyclist. I just have to do it because I have to do it. Yeah, so 
let's get into it. So ni wekelewa muzigo, muzigo ambao I'm the one to handle it and that is me presenting my project on uh, Monday. Today is on Saturday, so I have today is Saturday, Sunday and Monday. I've been planning to start familiarizing myself with the project since back then, since this return, but hey, we need to put last minute. I have to do I have to do things the last minute before this is a how. So it's still early because I have tomorrow and I have Monday morning, like from 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. Yeah. So I've broken this down into about five steps of how I'm strategizing. It was group work and uh, we have the project that is in form of a book booklet and then we have a presentation that is in form of slides. Uh, so what I'm planning to do is step one is to write notes, write short notes from the slides. The slides are about 30 pages, so I'll write my own short notes from from my from the project. Step two is writing notes from my short notes. I'll do now my own slides. Step three is to read on the project. The project is about a book. I don't know, about 70, 80 pages ago, but it's just a soma, but I'm the one who's supposed to be the captain of the ship. So I'll read on the project. Then step four is to cram whatever is in the project and the slides. Then step five is on the D-Day to present. Then step six is to to finally delete everything because 844 is trash and I'll be basically done with 844. So I'll start by reading and uh, I'll start by making a short notes before I read the notes. Uh, how, how would you start a channel? As long as you've already signed into your YouTube account, you have a channel. Only that you may or may not have subscribers, but you can always upload and yeah, that's basically it. Then this was supposed to be a sit down video, but because living in a bed sitter, I do not have a dining table and neither do I have a study table. So we are doing this from my bed. Yeah, it's quite big. So I'm pretty sure to start to share. Another question is the challenges that I face. Yeah. Uh, personally, I do not have any equipment. I use, I blog using my phone and edit using my phone. So yeah, it's quite hard because sometimes the angles, I do not have a tripod, I do not have a stand, I use my own improvisation, so the angles might be challenging, also the lighting, like in my previous video I noticed that the lighting was too much because of the white background in the kitchen, and also today I think the lighting is going to be too much, but I'll just figure a way out to edit, yeah, so uh, uh, the presentation, uh, the slides look like this, there are 30 pages, so first of all, it has an hour. Because if it's like page one, you can have pictures of happy, you can have happy. Page two, you can have space in a social page. Page three, you can have diagram, a minor. So just to make, to make myself familiar with what I got myself into. So, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. This thing has too many formulas. No kuchini. And uh, a few diagrams. Yeah. So it has like about 10 pages of diagrams, conclusion, and uh, introduction. So basically, the written pages are like 20, 22 apple. Also, another thing that people have been requesting for is my bed seat apartments. Do you want to talk about mini But I've been skeptical about doing this that blog but finally I did it and it's in my phone those I edit but it will come up later when I feel like I'm comfortable uploading it but yeah the video is already there and edited it's very raw another disclaimer is that this blog will be all over because I'm doing so many things I have to catch up like this project we are supposed to present it in March before Miss Rona happened like we are supposed to present the next week before I started my exam so Miss Rona happened and we had to shut down yeah, which was, I think, the worst idea or the worst decision the government made. Like, if at all we could have waited two more weeks, I could, I will not be having this kind of stress. So, I'm having to do a lot of things right now because I have to catch up from where we left, left on, uh, from where I left on the proposal. I have to catch up. That was back in October. So, I have to catch up from October to August. In two days, yeah. Uh, 
then also a few people have been concerned about my english and why i struggle with my speaking in english well as long as you in the it about two hours so this is the reason yeah like this is the reason i'm here as to why i struggle struggle but with english well, the challenges that i face is for a shoot and these such things is number one the english number two the literature the wordings then like for my first video it took me about six hours pilau from the setup to when i finished so after i finished cooking that was where the task was to shoot like the whatever prepared then during the test then it was too much work we gonna the test test at around uh, 5 30. that was way too many hours then at times kizongo pia inako there he did not have the literature he did not have the words so there's this particular time i was uh, shooting uh, a blog i think it was vegetable rice on the vegetables themselves and the kizongo was not even coming so i decided after very many shots and takes to write a script so after the script i wrote the script and uh, like i speak hapo kanda ya stibu then uh, i read it but i was also in panic mode so but we manage we manage we manage yeah so those are the challenges uh, also deleting content like a footage a footage or two you have to redo them which is not the best experience yup do i have some failed recipes whoa 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 Okay, you see mingi, ni kambi ni tuwevi, but moji is not a failed even ye, I'm too lazy to do, to perfect it. But the one enye ime ni challenge sana is red recipe. He recipe, I've tried all I can, I've tried this recipe about 18 times, yeah, 18, literally 18 times. Uh, the 18th time I did last week and it was also a fail. So what happens is the bread becomes very dense, but I got bread proofer that's supposed to help the bread in rising so i'll try it for the 19th time sometimes on tuesday after i've finished with my presentation then i'll see how it goes Ziki Shindikana. i'm not quitting i'll try it some other time but later mm. laundry or dishes are uh, neither 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 i'm one lazy human being but did i die and we are yeah video request yeah you have a pita tour that has been the most requested video though could other recipes that have been requested but i'm not sure then because i was on a break so i'll take a few minutes i write some short shorts then i'll be back to answer more questions
like to go spaces of salt and black pepper and uh, all spices when I'm cooking the white plain rice. Yeah, those are my to go spices. Go, is a lot of apple juice. Zina to me kanga, but not killer siku, like once in a while. Once in a while, you know, you have to cook something that needs a few extra ingredients a few extra spaces yeah so zikiwa hapo jua zimanishi ya tizote na natumika na siku moja on a lazy day i'll just use salt and black pepper and that's and that's it yeah also i do not mention cooking oil as my as a as an ingredient in my videos because i do not have any good reason <laughs> around 12.36 in the a.m. I don't know what I've been doing the whole sa sa Sunday, but after I woke up, I don't know Kuliandaji, then I've just realized that it's 7 in the p.m., so I've been sitting on this laptop uh, since 7. It's currently 12. I am not even almost done. I have a long way to go, so I'll go fresh and Kiasi, then I'll be back to continue. So let's see Kila Lakos. Hey! If last minute was a person, it is me. It is me. The presentation starts at nine, and uh, I'm number four. So I have to do what a man has to do. Yeah. So. Hmm. so this is how I wash my forehead. Wow. I wash it na yo shanga kama hembe. It's so huge. I love this baba I wanted to kunyongezea kifadi kingine. No routine at all, it took rush na koka usona maji. Then we are done. So oh then uh, there are some people who are always concerned about my nails. Like they always bother that what's happening with my nails or what do I apply uh for free. I'll tell you that I do nothing to my nails. Uh naturally evil. So what happens with them they are quite hard. Then Goziangu is quite pale, like so that's why they become very dark and uh, shiny at times and uh, yeah so zikime hukujui na kwa white sana then this other place becomes a little bit shiny yeah so i guess i'm answered because it seems to bother a lot of people mm. let me see what you want salon i don't go to the salon and then i have a skin care too so that's this kind of so let me go finish what i was doing then i'll be back oh then uh, I see if I can sleep for an hour or 30 minutes, then 